So where would you like to start? What's more interesting for you, the daddy issues or the drugs? I like to start with the daddy issues because it's a very organic segue into the drugs. Lainey Brooks got married to a great man, and I had a couple great kids living in the suburbs of New Jersey and on paper has a very ideal life. How much do you love me? <gasps> oh, good. <laughs> She's doing destructive things and hiding it well, and it works fine for her for periods of time until it doesn't. The whole idea of her not being a very redemptive character, it's hard to understand unless you've loved somebody like this before, and I think many of us have loved very self-destructive people. She gave the kid a huge smile. Whatever it took, he knew he was gonna marry that girl. And did he? I marry you a hundred times. It's a scary role, and she wouldn't be the first person that I would think of. And so the fact that she wanted to do this, I thought was incredibly ballsy and incredibly cool. And it just, it speaks again to her intelligence and her talent and her creative growth as an artist. Why did you stop taking your meds? They were making me fat. That's both That's true. So you'd rather be insane? You know, somebody of Sarah's talent being involved in a film that's so utterly different than the way we know her, and just said to me, this is gonna be a huge artistic risk and I wanted to be a part of it. Amy Koppelman was somebody I didn't know, and she had written a book called I Smile Back, and she is a big Howard Stern fan like me. And she heard me on Howard, um, and I happened to be talking about, I think I was talking about my book, which is a memoir, and I, it's talking about having depression, and, and the way I was talking about it, which I do not recall, she really connected with, and she thought, wow, this is Lainey. I wasn't looking for a dramatic role. I never am looking for anything. I uh, always just kind of stumble upon things. It's just dumb luck. I actually believe that comedians can make some of the uh, best dramatic performers. So much of comedy is drawn from a real deep insight into the human condition, and very often it is drawn from the darkness. I think Sarah did such a good job of finding her good side and her maternal side and her desire to do well. She showed that in her relationship with her kids, and she showed that when she's trying with Bruce and trying to appreciate and absorb this life that she has, which is so privileged and blessed. Why didn't you call me? You were in the hospital. I mean the 30 years before that. <laughs> oh my gosh! She is a combination of depression from her past and anxiety of her future and what her future will be because of her past. I don't understand why you're so angry. I'm not angry, I'm scared. What, what are you scared of? Everything. She's so charming, and she's so engaging, and you trust her. As an audience member, you weren't sure that this is what you signed up for to begin with, but you're gonna go with her anyway. Don't you wanna be happy? <sighs> what do you want? I'd love to smile like that again. <laughs>